Hi, I'm Action Jacqueline and welcome to my channel where every workout is a celebration of what your body is capable of. And here I'm going to help you build that strong, lean dancer's body with the flexibility and mindfulness of a yogi. Ready? Let's get started. Okay, it's time to sculpt our booties. And for this one, I'm using ankle weights, but if this is your first time, I recommend not using any, and then you can add ankle weights on later. So we're gonna start with our left leg, and we're gonna do all the exercises on the left side. So let's go. So we're starting with hydrants, lifting up, lower, up, lower. So I am taking it at a, a little bit of a quicker pace, if this is too quick for you, just slow it down a bit and make sure that shoulders are over your wrists, hips are over your knees. Here we go, next exercise, tap in, tap in. So I'm tapping my toe and pulling my knee in, tap in, tap in, great. So I purposely made this challenging so that you can come back to this workout and get stronger and stronger every single time. Great, keep that core nice and tight. Here we go, now we're gonna go hydrant and tap to the side. Hydrant, tap to the side, lift, and tap and lift and tap Woo. all right I'm sure you're already feeling the burn I love these quick 10 minute burners because they're so effective and here we go next exercise lift lower my foot is flexed so lift lower lift lower really use your core you're gonna feel your obliques a lot in this as well which is awesome because you're using your core keep going lift lower lift lower nice all right, now lower onto your right elbow. We're gonna tap to the side, cross over. So tap, bend, reach, tap, bend, reach. So you notice my foot slightly behind me and across to the side. So if there was a clock around me, but around four or five o'clock. Good, tap, reach, tap, reach, tap, and reach. Beautiful, hold onto that core. Belly button is in nice and tight. You really are using your whole upper body, like your arms, your shoulders, your abs, great. Keep going, tap and reach and tap and reach. I'm sure you're already starting to feel it. Here we go, hold it out there and pulse. Reach, reach, reach. So I'm bending and straightening. Bend, reach, bend, reach, bend, reach. Out at that diagonal, good. Reach, bend, reach, bend, reach. Keep going and all right, let's come on up. Now we're gonna reach and over. Now you're gonna lift and up. Good, so you're kind of on a side plank position. Shoulders over wrists and here we go, tap and up reach so my arm is just flowing over my head and now these are really quick transitions but the more that you come back to this workout the easier it'll get good so hold it out there and then we're gonna do little lifts up with the back leg as the arm circle so it takes a little bit of coordination and you might fall you saw me lose my balance there for a second but it takes practice so just keep doing it good you're doing awesome I know it burns. Okay, let's pull it in and reach. Elbow to knee and reach. Actually make contact with your knee and your elbow. In and reach, in and reach. Stay strong on the standing arm so the hand is underneath the shoulder, using your shoulders and your biceps. Good, pull in and reach. You're gonna feel those obliques as well. That's why I love these moves because you're really sculpting your whole body even as we just focus on the legs. Nice, pull in and reach, in all right let's move on to our next move staying still in the same leg cross over and then reach up cross and up good so the leg is just going straight up behind me up and i'm on my right elbow pressing the left hand into the floor good tap and reach tap and reach good you could always take it at a slower pace but you're doing amazing i know this burns but it's so so worth it you're gonna feel amazing after good keep going up and tap let that booty burn feel the fire oh yes here we go tap and reach and here we go hold it up there now little pulses reach up and up and up bend straighten bend straighten so i want you to actually engage that glute up there at the top bend reach bend reach bend reach yes you, there you go all right now we're gonna bend hips go back and then reach back hips go back extend the leg back good so I'm giving a little kind of like a child's pose and then extending to that arabesque behind me reach so a little bend and reach a little sit back and reach sit it back and reach sit and reach good probably feeling your heart rate starting to rise a bit the whole body is working we are burning calories we are sculpting our bodies lengthening getting that dancer's body here we go and then hold the leg up there and lift and lift and lift this really really tones and sculpts your booty and hips 
really strengthens your hips, which helps support your entire body. Keep going, lift and lift. All right, we're almost there on this side. We're gonna place the foot down, lift up into an attitude. Tap the foot down, lift up. So my foot's flat down on the ground, almost like a little lunge, and then I swoop it and lift up behind me. Good, and lift. Foot on the floor and then lift up to attitude. Good, lift up to attitude, tap the foot down. I know you're gonna have to use that core a lot to get that foot forward in front of you like that, good. And if it doesn't happen the first time, that's okay. Keep coming back here. Every time you come back, you're gonna get stronger and stronger. You're doing awesome, we're almost there. I know, <laughs> we're doing everything on this one side and you're gonna definitely feel it. And that's how you really, really build strength. Okay, tap it out, loosen it out. I know the burn is there, but the burn is showing you that you are getting an amazing workout right now. Okay, take a little breather right here. <sighs> nice, deserved stretch. Take a big inhale, exhale. And I kind of like to do this little side, little stretch thing. There's really no name for it, but it just feels really good. Okay, you ready for the other side? Let's go. We're gonna start with the hydrants, lifting up and lowering, up and lowering, good. Shoulders are over wrists, make sure you're in proper form. Hips are over your knees, and you're holding on to your core as the knee lifts and lower, lifts and lower. Great job, keep going. Now we're gonna tap and in, tap and in tap and in and I am going pretty quick here with the moves so you can take them a little bit slower and every time you come back you'll get stronger and stronger nice tap and in tap and in you're doing awesome tap in tap in hold on to that core try to keep the shoulders as stable as possible now lift and tap so you're gonna do hydrant and then tap side hydrant tap side hydrant tap side good hydrant tap side beautiful try to hold on to those shoulders try not to wiggle around too much beautiful feel the burn enjoy it oh yes here we go and we're gonna lift lower lift lower the foot is flex leg is straight lift lower lift lower good and up and up and up and up good keep going and lift hold into your core okay good now lower onto your left elbow and then we're gonna tap side and bend extend diagonal good tap and reach tap and reach now we're going to start to hit the lower booty good tap and reach tap and reach make sure that you're still holding on to that shoulder so you want to still use your shoulder a lot good tap and reach and tap and reach good tap reach keep it going this is it this is where you start to really feel the burn and this is where you get stronger this is where the change happens this is what you came for good now pulse and reach so you're gonna bend reach bend reach bend reach to the point where you're really squeezing your booty up at the top so find that position for yourself point your toe and go to the straightest leg possible good now slowly come up onto your hands come into your side plank and then reach and over so I have a nice little arc with my arm and I reach towards my leg good lift and lower lift and lower beautiful reach and over good hold on to your core the core is working a lot here as well good lift and lower try to make the arms smooth I know even though you're burning try to look graceful and happy maybe even a little smile on your face that always helps your body relax more good and we're gonna take little circles with the arms I know this kind of feels challenging on the brain but it's always good to challenge your mind like that good reach and reach and circle the arm nice and smooth all the way around as the leg is just reaching out to the side beautiful now elbow to knee in and reach Ooh, i fell again <laughs> this one is challenging on your balance in and reach you've got this in and reach in and reach i know these moves might be completely new to you but just know that every time you come back you're building a long lean strong dancer's body good and we're creating flexibility as well a strong mind body connection nice you're doing awesome elbow to knee and extend okay lower all the way down here we go cross it behind and reach up lift and lift and lift beautiful now we don't want to go too much into the low back and the way you avoid that is by using your core so pull that stomach into your into the low spine to help protect and support the pose good tap and reach tap and reach so knee taps down extend through the toes tap and reach tap and reach good okay I'm gonna tuck my tag in there okay extend the foot good and reach 
reach, reach, reach. So again, you want to find that catch up there with the glute. Extend the leg as straight as possible. Nice. Okay, now we're going to sit back and reach. Sit and reach right here again. Find that catch in the glute. Give a little squeeze and engage the quad even to make sure that the leg is super straight. So a little sit back and extend. Little sit back and extend. Nice, sit back and extend. Oh yes, okay, here we go. The burn is happening, I know. This is it, this is what you came for. This is where you are going to change. This is where the change happens. Nice, right here with the burn. Can you do one more? Yes, you can, good. And reach, little sit and reach. You've got this. Nice, big, deep breaths. Okay, hold the leg out there and lift up, up. Make sure you are breathing. Inhaling in through the nose, exhaling out through the nose, making sure that you're giving your body energy that way. Lift and lift. Good. Okay, now we're going to step forward in that little lunge and swoop it back into attitude. Step and lift. Step and lift. You're doing awesome. Step and lift. Okay, hold on to your core right here especially. And I want you to dome the upper back just slightly as you step forward. You notice how I kind of push the floor away with my hands and shoulders to make space for the leg. And lift, good, tap and lift. I love this one because it also is mobilizing your hip, stretching out your hip, as well as working your core, your glutes, your glute med. Lots of things working here, I love it. Okay, this is it, we are almost done. Keep it up, keep it up, just a few more. Ooh, you are all done, congratulations. Let's do a quick cool down. Leaning back on your hands, place your ankle over your knee with your foot flexed, and this is going to help stretch out your glutes, all the muscles that we just worked. Okay, let's move on to the other side. Oh, this should feel so, so good after all of the work that we did. And just remember that every time you show up here for a workout with me, all you have to do is press play and you're going to follow the workout with me and you are going to get the results that you want. So make sure that you check in with me on Instagram, StretchyFit app and hashtag StretchyBabe. Comment down below, subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you in the next workout. Bye.